core of the science of the IPCC is based on uh, a set of assumptions about how the natural climate system responds to what is really in terms of a, of a percentage of atmospheric gas, tiny. Yes, it's an increase, it's the Industrial Revolution, but it's relatively a tiny contribution. But the models, as the years have gone by, and we have developed highly sensitive remote sensing satellites and balloons to measure temperature of thousands of different locations and levels of the atmosphere, there's a growing, growing gap between observed measured temperature and the predictions of the IPCC who even acknowledges that in the most recent assessment report that perhaps, oh dear, perhaps we may have assumed too much climate sensitivity through the role of water vapor to increase CO2. And they all, even the IPCC also concludes that extreme weather events currently are no more extreme or no more frequent than recently. So those two core uh, uh, claims that the, that the that the temperature would increase at a certain rate because of a certain amount of continual CO2 emissions and that this would create weather havoc, if you will, has not occurred.